But first, our top story honoring a hero. In just a few hours, our community will say goodbye to Tyler Herndon, the Mount Holly police officer was shot and killed in the line of duty last week. Tonight, crews are closing streets and preparing for the service in Kings Mountain. We're expecting to see heavy traffic tomorrow between noon and 6 p.m. before and after the funeral starts. Thank you for staying up with us tonight. I'm Fred Shropshire. Hundreds of people are expected to attend the funeral and watch the procession. WCNC Charlotte's Brandon Goldner has more on how you can honor Officer Herndon tomorrow. The organizers for Officer Tyler Herndon's funeral are encouraging people to watch the funeral service online instead of coming to the church in person. But they are asking people when the procession happens to come outside and stand along the streets to pay their respects. Preparations already underway at First Baptist Church. Gaston County emergency management workers set up cones blocking entrances to the church's parking lot, which in a few hours will be filled with police cars from across the region as officers pay their respects to a brother in blue. The funeral service will start at 2 p.m. and is expected to last about 45 minutes to an hour. From First Baptist, a procession will head west on West King Street before turning onto Pfeiffer Road and passing Officer Herndon's alma mater, Kings Mountain High School. The school will dismiss early so students and staff can pay their respects along the road. The procession will stop somewhere along Bethlehem Road for about 15 minutes. That's when Officer Herndon's body will be transferred transferred onto a caisson, which will go the rest of the way to the cemetery at Bethlehem Baptist Church. About a block away from where Officer Herndon's funeral will be held, neighbors like Bobby Short lower their flags to half-mast and prepare for a mournful morning. Just a lot of heartache, you know, what the family's going through. Couldn't imagine losing one of my own kids. A sad situation that we have to watch families go through. And the viewing will happen here at First Baptist Church starting from 10 a.m. and lasting till 1 p.m. It is open to the public. In Kings Mountain, Brandon Goldner, WCNC Charlotte. And once again, Officer Herndon's funeral will be held tomorrow at First Baptist Church at 2 p.m. We will broadcast the service live here on WCNC Charlotte and online at WCNC.com.